or five minutes of this game, you, you will see it. Uh, uh, they'll go against each again, other. Again, a Brownlee Lonely matchup. And we're just about to get into play. Underway with Jordan against the Philippines. Jordan has the first possession here. And they attack quickly. They shot them almost the 15 foot line. Will not work. Philippines brings it up slowly and Brownlee the recipient on the other end. Spanny thumbs up. High. Nice. No great pass. Oh. Chapman just missing out. Did curl in. That was just great communication among those two teammates, uh, Scotty and Chapman. Oh, I got the club from the uh, So we have Chapman on the uh, on the Hollis Jefferson. And both sides have missed in their initial four race. And I think that's the something that. You know, when he first came to the Philippines with TNT, really didn't have such a good outside shot. Yes. Then he realized, he realized that, hey, I'm the import. I have the ball and most of the time. Might as well shoot away. He's effective for perimeter. Uh, yung mga 18 feet, 20 yeah, feet, yeah. yeah. yung, yung, yung three points. So he can make it. And not his usual attempt. Yes. yes. He won't try it that often. But he turned still scoreless. To the wing we go, the open shot. Succeeded so far. Pass to the wing. Up fake. No attempt. Well, I thought about it. Hollis Jefferson considering the shot to three. Here we go with another scoreless attempt. Good challenge coming from my job. And he's, in, he's giving up that uh, shot to Ronde. Okay, here's a tap from behind. But it will be considered a foul on Ahmad Al Kawaii is the um, captain of this team. He scored 17 points against Bahrain. Here's that last foul. And this guy's got a double-double machine here for Jordan. His career playing for the national team. And we're going to have a baseline inbound with Scotty also doing the honors. Still scoreless after three and a half minutes. You get the feeling this could be a low scoring ball game. Yes. I, I, I agree with that, Dahil. Uh, there's so much. There's a premium on size. Uh -huh. Both teams trying to match up with the size factor of the other team. Okay, usually, ganyan, pag nag yan, instead of a uh -huh. small ball, it becomes a slower game and a low scoring match. Almanesh is on the floor, number seven. Looks like a big 6 5. Trying to pursue. Justin Brownlee, who now makes up for his basket. Brownlee does, does not uh, settle for a shot outside this time. He takes it strong to the basket. We need the uh, early basket. Yes. Confidence. So you can't get it from 
Brown outside. Scored by Tasama Kampau. Nag-iba yung mentality ni Brown. Hindi nung nilabas si Aguayli. Suddenly, he wants to attack. He knows the seven footer is not there on the floor. And he knows he can finish long to the basket. This is the first one. So, late in the si Brown. Brown is free throw. Fourth coming.
di ba? Kaya nang alam po. Possibly. Possibly, uh -huh. yes. Uh -huh. Ayan, time out tayo mga boss, no? At maraming maraming salamat sa mga patuloy na nag-donate sa atin. For G, Iri, on that plate. And then, sa mga kumuha ng way back. Body must stop on taking care of that. Inside, Kwame is clobbered by the double team. Cuts it up. Gets a foul again. Look at these two 6-11s. Ang sikip ng paint natin dito. May pahal ko. May Kwame, then not Aldwyde and Kuhano. Ito yung hapo na nung ganda ng lead pass nito. Free throws worth coming for Ange Kwame. Five-point lead by the Philippines. Seeing action for the first time is Mohamed Hussain. Another 68. Nakala mo nagpalasa na. No. Lead na sila. Nakala mo. Akala mo, liliit yung size na. Bigla mo gusto sana i-analyze. May mga tao ko play snowball. Diyan. Wow, may this is the first free throw. Kaya maraming salamat, Rod Santiago. Salamat sa 20 Idol. Manny G, maraming salamat sa 100. Yan, no? from 16. Gets it to go. First basket. We'll get the fourth to give that down. That means it's a good question. I think you're right, man. You know, I'm going to eat it. 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 In the meantime, he plays a press. Why not? We're tied all of a sudden. And that's when they are very dangerous. We have to stop. Ayan, time out muli tayo mga idol Ganda ng laban, mga boss, no? Si Dwight, he had to be more patient on the offensive end And ang message dito ni Coach Lim Kong Because they've struggled a bit on the offensive end This is a 7 to nothing run Coming from Jordan Tries 
the floor came back in. Hello, we're jumping up and down. But I'm not, I'm not about to cut the door. That time somebody may say it's the next one. field goals itong uh, Gilas that's their first three pointer and Jordan continues to attack it and they score again from three point distance this time it is number team Kusen that's his first three pointer of the game but uh, the important thing is for play for Jordan because that's a big man yeah taking a three six eleven rounding corner no nice ah walang kalaban dun ganda ng timing that's what we need from Anj Kwame. He needs to become a factor on the offensive end. Especially with the offensive rebounding. Yan ang labang natin so far. Considering sila yung mas mulaki, no? Huh? And I mean, tsaka, yun. Dami kasi nila miss na kung isa. Yes. Huh? And then, that's the reason why Tim Cohn will always will use us a big lineup. Pretty much this entire game. Oh, line shot by CJ Perez. Kwame challenges. He changed up shot there, although there was no shot. He forced the Jordanian to pass up the opportunity. The cut inside, the swing to the open man. No, no connection. But the follow-up is taken care of by Bahamut. Now this is where seeing the Jordan offense at work right now. Good ball movement. Offensive rebounds. That's the first for Jordan. So this is a, a Catholic only that we're dominating so far. I'm trying to decide on what to do. CJ Perez finds the gap close. Corner shot. No. I have to that. Chapman will take that from time to time. Uh, you three pointer, especially from the corners. Which is the nature of the tire gilly. In the meantime, Bahana for the second. The big shot inside. Boy, oh, he's on fire. Back to back baskets here. Again, created by the Here for Jumar, but he's got he's needed 
I'm not here, you know. Uh, can't get back into the game right away. He's, and he said he's working on it. And he has, he has I'm having a frustrating game so far. Play offensive end, and missed the long three pointer. Meron siyang alley of lane na easy shot, but that missed. Now, Coach Tim Cohn will go to the small lineup as we will have a Lassiter. Better offensive spacing for sure with Marshall. Now, let's uh, hope that uh, Justin Brownlee and Aftana can hold their own inside the paint. What a move. Yes, the shake and bake. Beat Junmar Pardo at the end. Bati Mustafa had uh, 11 points against Parade the other day. Here's Aftana, the winning side. He's taken only one attempt so far. Seven point lead. Complete turnaround in the game now. No? Uh, 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 we're having problems on the offensive. Shanta, yes, Shanta, Shanta. If you cannot hesitate, you're talking about I'm sure the bench was yelling at him to shoot. It might happen in front of the Philippine bench, and there's always bound to be somebody yes. who's supposed to say or count it down. And I, I, I don't really know the reason. this guy
something you can take advantage of. Kasi, hindi naman, ang three-point shooting natin, isa pa lang. Mm -hmm. Probably, di ba? June Mar with the front end. Great tip. Jordan, after taking 
basket here. Brownlee unable to get it to go. Philippines secures the offensive carom. Downstairs to Brownlee, long outside pass. Scotty goes all the way with a twist through. What a move there by Scotty, and we're gonna need a lot of those offensive uh, brilliance, individual brilliance from guys like Scotty Thompson and Justin Brownlee. Lead has been cut down to 12. Ball will stay there. Biggest lead stood at 13. Philippines had a lead of seven in the early goings. But that's already a thing of the past. That was very early, 13-6. Yeah. We were ahead by seven, and then Jordan had the 10 to nothing run. And they have not surrendered the lead ever since. Here's Hollis Jefferson probing inside, launches that left-handed shot. It's an air ball. It'll go the other way. That's one stop. Let's see if we can have uh, maybe three, four consecutive stops here to start the third quarter. We need energy here. Uh, and a lot more intensity after. Here's CJ Perez. I know he can fly. That's why Greg Curl by Jumar. Lineup with a lot more spacing. That will open the floor for Justin Brownlee. 
far. We've outscored Jordan here, 13 to 3. Jordan Bernay Lamas, Jake Bay on its way, yes! Excellent after the timeout there coming from uh, Jordan to get the ball into their big man. And then it looks like EL Dwyer. Maraming assist ito. Oh. Average is 5 assists a game. Very good numbers for a big man. Okay, that's 5 seconds remaining. On the shot clock, yeah. that's it! And you can see Coach Dimbron saying, yes, CJ, yes, CJ. Because we need the scoring. That's a baseline cut. They take the ball away, and the Philippines, one of the leaders in the number of steals in the tournament, takes another one away. Chapman making a decision. 48-45. All together, different ball game. CJ attacks. There's a foul. On Collins Jefferson. Trying to find that uh, screen set by Ben Chapman. There you go. Oh, there. Uh, how about him? Come on, Collins Jefferson. But he's swung at Chapman. This is an open three pointer. Better be that we are getting on the CJ. Japet, you're gonna hit one sooner or later.
here. We all know how good Londay Hollis Jefferson is. And over the limit, the bio. And we're down to the last 33 seconds. But it should be a good fourth quarter as these two teams. Both undefeated will really smash and blow at each other in the fourth quarter. Look at this play. Very nice. It will be a reveal. I'm pretty sure it will be better than this one than the other NBA Avengers. Oh. Classic. Turnovers. Early to Philippines. Philippines average 16.7 turnovers per game. Napaka hesitant talaga ni Calvin Plano sa offensive end. Ah, no. Here's Hollis Jefferson. Wiggles against Sultana. That shot will not work. Tim Mint will work. And Jordan will have at least a seven point lead. Unless we get something here. And it'll stay at that 59 52 at the end of three quarters. Coming your way. Kumisa sa hapan ng pangalan nila, hindi magkasa sa uniform. Ini siya na lang, like Papa Red. That's Alex on his jersey. And here we go. Seven point lead by Jordan. Ah! Another steal! Agents drop it to some turnover. Usually, ang, kala ang kalaban mo sa quarterfinals, hindi yung number one din. Ito kasi ito, by default, ang kakalabanin natin, if we win our next game, one of the top teams, it could be China, it could be Korea, or Japan. So, malaki, malaki ang implications. Okay, okay. So, I need to try him, knocking the ball away. Awkward shot, missed it. But he was right there. This game, we are really having problems of finishing uh, yeah. out of the rim. Yeah, but the end of the third quarter, no lie, no? All this Jeff was responsible for dousing water on our up. Oh, it was a foul. Could be an Oftana here. It is Oftana.
restaurant day will will return for another tour of duty with the TFT team. Why not? Quality important. Oh, yes. Other teams also were uh, fighting for him. But look at this, the way they restored this game in their favor. Very impressive how they responded after we tied the game at 52. And they're stuck with just four points. Since that time, 19 points altogether by Jordan. In three point chatting. Brownlee tries to take over, but we're missing badly. The way we play that second quarter seems to be bad. Parang naubos yung energy natin dito. This is defended well by JP, but still, Ronde Hollis Jefferson finds a way. Ano na lang yun, a firm grip on the ball. That's Pontic Pectus.
Jordan looks well on its way to have recovered and they were on the verge of losing this game massively and they recovered in time. Because the Philippines already had a great momentum in the third quarter and uh, the dealers team just lost it. For Qatar, I think we were playing Qatar okay. in the next round and then if we win that game, we will win the quarterfinals. So we will not officially as of now. We will not win the quarterfinals. And Jordan will win. Jordan, Jordan is in. Because the number one, uh, the top seeds of the four groups are in the quarterfinals. So we will not win the qualifications match. And in the quarterfinals, it's not the last one. Yes, it's not the last one. You know, all these Jefferson has seen the floor lying down on a lot. Right. 